Today we're in one of my favorite communities in Orange Park that's a little known secret. We're gonna talk about it right now in this video. Let's go! Duck it. Gentry, aka Dr. Real Estate Jax. If you have been here before, you know what I'm gonna say. Get up, get your own order, your family. Now, if you haven't been here before, do me a favor, like, subscribe, hit the bell notification. As I try to put out two videos a week, we, we try, guys. We're getting back to it. It's been crazy. But today, I'm in a neighborhood by Dream Finders. I, I, I love this neighborhood. Price per square foot, amazing. And I'm with Christian Screen. Christian. So Christian is my guy out here, right? We've gotten multiple people in homes in this neighborhood, coming from Hawaii, coming from Japan. And so I had to highlight this community because very few people know about it. So I'll let you see a little bit around and then we're going to jump right into it. So you got to see the beauty of the neighborhood. So we're going to talk to Chris now. Let him kind of explain some of the things that are out here, some of the standard features that you're going to receive. Why is this an outstanding community? Chris. Dr. Man. How long have you been selling properties for? I've been with Dream Finders. I'm going on five years now. Previously, I was in Los Angeles. I sold real estate for about 10 years, but I was in general, like, what do you do now? Okay. All right. That's a whole different market. All different game. What's made you stay with Dream Finders 5? Dream Finders has a nice niche of, it's it still has that small town builder feel. Mm -hmm. We still are able to do some custom things that a lot of big box builders can't do. Mm -hmm. um, at the same time, we build a lot of homes. We can accommodate a lot of people. Uh, we have a strong presence in the Jacksonville market. And I just love the, the uh, family atmosphere of the company. Right, the crazy part about this place is I probably live seven, eight minutes away from it. Right? Yeah, I, I live about seven, eight minutes away from this place. And it's funny, I never came down the street. I don't even know why I didn't come down the street because this place is kind of tucked away and will for preserves. Like some of y'all have seen the pictures already. It's calm, it's peaceful, it's relaxed, right? Everybody talks about Orange Park and they're like, oh, it's too busy. But where this is located? Yeah, it's funny that you say that. I One of the most common things I hear from people that eventually end up buying homes in here is, mm -hmm. I didn't even know you guys were down here, right? <laughs> yeah, we're really centrally located. Um, Oakley Town Center, five minutes away, shops, movies, restaurants, uh, highway system of Jacksonville under 10 minutes away. So you can get around the city really easily from this location. But like you said, it still has that tucked away feel. All my lots back on to preserve or water. Very few of them back on to another home site, which people love about this community standard features so one of my i love the life is like on to me right we got our house out here for a huge footprint like huge footprint and one thing when we walked in we seen a lot of things you know we go to builders they max it out they make it seem like this is what you're going to get um majority of the time it's too maxed out you not get any of that stuff what are some of the standard features and that's what excited me about this the standard features that you guys have so again, if you were to compare most big box builders, everything seems to be an upgrade. But mm -hmm. with us, we have granite countertops, we have 42 inch cabs, uh, we have tile flooring as standard. But again, another niche that we, we can offer is we still can customize a lot of things where most builders these days are what you see is what you get, no change. Right. Right. So um, people love that about the product that we offer is that we can still customize it to their personality, mm -hmm. uh, what they love about a home and able to make it their home. Cover patios. Like, majority of the plans have cover patios, guys. And if you're living down in Florida, you move into Florida, you want that outdoor feel. To have a cover patio is a big deal now. 
big time, big double front doors, right? Most people are blown away by that. I mean, if you and I are moving, we <laughs> love that feature, but it adds a beautiful element to a home as well that most homes don't offer as far as the builder. And you don't see that right? It's, it's generally an upgrade. It's generally something they want you to pay extra for. I love that the sliding glass doors, three. Like three panel. Three panel sliding doors when you walk into it. The bathroom, the walk-in shower, detached with a tub. Yeah. Is it majority of the unit? So I know that's been a big deal for people coming from up north. They have a problem with the knees, arms, things like that. They want to be able to take a bath and relax. Set for tub and shower. Absolutely. Yeah. Majority of builders aren't offering it. Right. Matter of fact, majority of builders aren't offering tubs. I didn't know that. Yeah. Sure. Yeah. Majority of the builders we go to, that's not even a feature that they offer. Look at that. I'm learning from you. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So the neighborhood overall, tell me about the entire area. Um, one, it's a natural gas community, which is a rarity down in Florida. I get a lot of snowbirds coming down, people from up north where mm -hmm. gas is pretty normal. Right. So people love that about this community, that we're an all natural gas community, number one. Another one I touched on, we're, we're kind of set away of the, uh, we have that nice mixture of private, peaceful, quiet, but we're very central to a lot of city like amenities so. absolutely right around the right up the street you have with dixie you go down probably two miles you have Publix. you have what is it uh, all the depot the, the movie theater you got all that right so yeah. you, i mean you're close to a little bit of everything you are by 15 minutes you're close to orange park mall and like i said you don't deal with orange park track right. like i think that's the biggest thing that i love about this neighborhood that you don't deal with what people think is orange park that's right. Um, so that's that's one of the things that's always sold me on this area. Not just that. Let's talk about like, what amenities do we have? So in the neighborhood. we've got the pool, the clubhouse. Clubhouse has a, the pavilion has a kitchen in it. You can reserve it for parties. Mm -hmm. uh, we got children's playground. We got a huge, um, what they call multi-purpose sports field. It's basketball for or baseball, frisbee, football, whatever you want to play out mm -hmm. there. Uh, we do have a dog park for dog lovers. They love that. Um, those are, those are the main highlights of our money. Okay. And house and price wise, I got to talk to you guys, right? Real quick. This area, if I take these same floor plans and I take them to St. John's County, or we take them to Amelia Island, you're talking about $200,000, yeah. right? One thing I love about this building in this location is the fact that square footage wise, they're, they're not too many buildings. That are giving you this much square footage for the price. Your was it your aunt that we we told about? Yeah. Well, like I, I love it like okay. I'll put a picture up. No, I ain't put a picture up. Go Thirty five hundred square foot home, right around five hundred thousand dollars. You're not going to get that. Um, another highlight I should have mentioned was that when you drove down that street, you passed into Clay County. So, from a family perspective, school system it's it's superior to Duval County. Mm -hmm. People love that about this community as well. So. We're in Clay County. It's an all-gap community. You got the the uh, the peacefulness of the preserve. So all those elements combined to make this such a winning community. Okay. All right. So let me do this, right? I know today, as we're shooting this video, they may not be here later, right? But I want you to give kind of the incentive that they're offering right now to purchase this neighborhood. So this never goes away that... It's a prerequisite if you want to purchase Dream Finders, you have to get pre-qualified with our lender. If you choose to use our lender, we pay all the closing costs. Okay. If you don't use our lender, we don't pay any closing costs. Um, and then we also are currently offering a $20,000 a $20, incentive if you wanted to build from dirt or off of one of our existing spec homes. Hmm. Yeah. How size? What do you be talking about? What's the range of how size? Smallest home we build is a three bed, two bath, 1700 square foot home. Mm -hmm. uh, we could start that at 299. Mm. That's, that's strong. <laughs> in this market? Yeah. Yeah, 1700 square feet. Now mind you, you add in your lot, you add in some nice upgrades. That home's probably gonna be at the 330 price mark. Right. But still, that's such a great value in this. In this. And this more, this right, yeah. right? Like, and that's why I say per square footage, what you get out here is much more than I've seen in most of the city, right? If I go down the street, probably five miles down to the Oak Leaf area, 
if we can take that 1,700 square foot home, but we can add about seventy, eighty thousand 80000 dollars to it, and that's what you'll find in Oakland. Yeah. Right. If I take the same model across town to, like I said, the South Side, you might talk about 100, 100, 120 thousand dollars more for that type of square footage and the standard features that actually come in this property. So it's definitely something that you guys want to think about when you're moving to Jacksonville, Florida. Like I, I work with him because Christian gets stuff done. Right. Things that most people and, and 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 what you know about me is I'm a relationship type person. So I try to stick one person everywhere I go because I like to form that relationship. And we formed that type of relationship here. So I wanted to get him on camera today and let you know about this neighborhood. So, Chris, I appreciate you. Doctor. Appreciate you. Pleasure to have been with you. And frankly, the feeling's mutual. I love working with you. And you, you've been a class act ever since you started coming into the neighborhood. So anytime I can help you, I love to do it. That's what's up. So we're going to get some people as homes out here, right? Like, that's what's going to happen. So if you guys look to move to Jacksonville, I keep telling you all the time. We want to be your boots on the floor. Like, give us a call. I'm going to put my phone number somewhere in here. Funny thing, me and Christian have been trying to suck in our stomach the whole time. I'm just putting that out. <laughs> <laughs> we both are like, oh, <laughs> barely great. I'm sweating and everything. It's crazy. But we want to be your boots on the ground, right? We, we want to be those, those people to help you get into a home that you really want. And I talk about it all the time. Like, please, like, give us a call. Shoot us a text message. Shoot us an email. We answer back in the meeting with myself. Well, my sister, Janelle, if you ever watch any, any other of my videos, you know her voice already. It's like, ah, it's me, Janelle. <laughs> Give us a call. We would really enjoy working with you and helping your home, helping your family find that home. But until next time, be great and choose excellence in everything you do.